Sources telling ABC News the president has admitted privately the next few days may make or break his campaign. A defiant President Biden staying the course, telling a Wisconsin radio show he's determined to beat Donald Trump in November, despite fallout from his admittedly poor debate performance last week. I had a bad night. I learned from my father, when you get knocked down, just get back up. Get back up. And, uh, you know, we're going to do, we're going to win this election. The president publicly standing firm, but privately, sources say Biden has acknowledged the next few days will be critical in determining whether he stays in the race. They said the president told at least two people he knows he has to perform well on upcoming appearances, including Friday's interview with ABC's George Stephanopoulos. The president, though, stumbling through parts of the 20-minute radio interview, accidentally giving credit to Trump before catching himself. And he wants to strengthen, he, I want to strengthen Medicare and Social Security. He wants to cut Social Security and Medicare. Still, the president sought to quell concerns last night about his mental acuity and his re-election path forward during a meeting with Democratic governors. Feedback was, we are all looking for the path to win. Meanwhile, former President Trump was allegedly caught on camera speaking poorly of the president and Vice President Harris. Trump appearing to be playing golf with his son Barron, according to the Daily Beast, and allegedly calling Biden broken down and Harris so expletive bad. The Biden-Harris campaign slamming Trump for his alleged comments with the list of accusations he's bad at, including lying and taking away women's rights. Who knows what other videotapes are going to arrive about Donald Trump and what other relationships. So there are just too many variables. Two Democrats have broken rank and called on the president to step aside. Now, sources say Biden believes he's still the best candidate to defeat Trump, but that he's keeping an open mind about the path forward. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.